chitlets. Shitlets. <laughs> Excuse me. What's good, family? It's your boy D Boy, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today we're gonna be reacting to Gordon Ramsay's uh, the worst. Hit, I'm sorry, the worst dishes on Kitchen Nightmares. I love Gordon Ramsay, man. He be snapping. Let's see how this one goes. Like always, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Drop some other videos y'all want me to watch. Different things y'all want me to react to, etc., etc., etc. Yeah, man. Let's get into it. Thank you. Some strange fixes on the wall. Are you ready? Yes, please. Okay. Thank you. Uh, right. Let's start with a little bowl of miso. Okay. And um, Akira mentioned the sushi pizza. He recommended that? Yeah. I wouldn't recommend it. No. No. I would not recommend the sushi pizza to anybody. Uh, I think it's vile. Gotta try the sushi pizza. Just out of Imagine owning a restaurant and your own employees be telling people, don't eat this shit. Good luck. Good luck. Um, the green tower, that sounds nice. And then let's end up with a little bit of the salmon, sashimi. I think that'll be enough. You got some of the best and some of the worst. Thank you. Thank you. Good. Excellent. Some of the best and some of the worst. No one's afraid to share their opinion here. soup doesn't taste very fresh it's not actually very hot either oh he's talking now somebody should go listen to what he's talking about thank you chef your green tower thank you Man, that's very salty that does that it is yeah is that normal yeah that's yeah. normal thank you thank you what is that that look like Oh, that look like some bullshit. So this is gray hair. Um, Are you I, finished with the green tower? No, it's just, I pulled out this disgusting hair. Yeah. Yeah, I'm definitely finished with that. Sorry. <laughs> I just wanted to just die, bury my head in the sand when that happened. Um, guys, there's a hair. In the green tower. You gotta be kidding me. It's always like a running joke. Like, oh my god, there's a lot of things going wrong. So Akira disappears. Do sashimi. Thank you. You're welcome. And is the salmon fresh? Yes, it is. Thank you. John, the salmon is fresh, right? Frozen. Frozen. This waitress is selling the fucking bag. It just tastes like it's frozen. How was your sashimi? That's definitely frozen. It's very, very chewy. My mistake, I was just informed. They are frozen. They're tasting frozen. Is that normally the way they freeze all the fish? Uh, I guess we get lazy with our food. Sushi pizza. Yeah. I've never been to a Japanese restaurant where I can have a pizza sushi style and a chef owner that's no longer in the kitchen. I'm nervous. Let's go with it. Okay. Um, that's the sushi pizza. It sure is. It's rice, salmon, crab, and mayonnaise. Some cheese. Wow. Thank you. Japanese pizza. You were right. That is an insult to pizza yeah? <laughs> and Japanese food. The chef had fair warning that it was going to be terrible. Mm. I told him not to get it. Coming in, chef. I'm ringing in his orders, okay? Okay. So be prepared. To me, it's Chef Ramsay's just another customer. I mean, as long as he likes my food, we're going to get along just fine. Good to go? Walking out. I think he's gonna love this salad. I mean, to grow lettuce. I mean, can't go wrong. Did he just say a grilled lettuce? Grilled salad. Come on. It is grilled. 
Are you still amazed? I'm shocked. I've never thought about it, but it's true. Like, wait, why are we grilling lettuce? Sorry for interrupting, just two seconds. But this is a first for me, a grilled Caesar salad. <laughs> Do you know, they actually grilled the lettuce. <laughs> Um, can you just show a hand if anyone else has ever had a grilled Caesar salad before? Anybody here, ladies? No, this is this is uh, what do we say, reality TV? But can you just imagine sitting in a restaurant and somebody gets up and just, hey, everybody, look at this bullshit. <laughs> you ever had some bullshit like this? <laughs> oh, that shit would be crazy as hell. No. Mm. Sorry for interrupting. Sorry. Oh, jeez. I always get nervous when a chef serves me the butt of the lettuce. When you've got the butt of the lettuce on, you can never clean the lettuce properly. And unfortunately, it's not very nice inside. Dry chicken. The salad looks hideous. Why is it so spicy? Everything is spicy, everything. Jesus. Thanks, Tony. Grilled Caesar salad. Let's see what a former nightclub manager has to offer the Brits abroad. Huge menu. Extraordinary menu. Um, and then different themes. Flamenco, burger night, kebab menu. Chinese chicken or pork. Confused. So what the fuck's going on? <laughs> if I'd wanted a Chinese, I would have gone to one. But I'm in Spain. Oh, he is an asshole. So what the fuck's going on? Let's hope Lawrence's signature dish of prawns and chocolate sauce gives me the flavor of the med. Cool, dear. I mean, it's worse than a chocolate sauce. It's um hot, over spicy chili chocolate sauce. But that's just stupid arrogance, really. Trying to match something that's never going to go. If that's how Lawrence serves up fresh local prawns, then I wonder what he's got in store for my fillet steak kebab. Well, he's gone for the kebab, which is our wow factor dish, when you know, it comes out on the hook. So I think he gets to see that bit of what we do. Yeah. Fuck me. Is that how they're always served? Oh, Jesus. Fuck me. <laughs> it's the kind of thing you imagine Jordan eating with a fucking hands behind her back. Is someone taking the piss? How can you expect <laughs> something like that? <laughs> that to be cooked at the same time a fillet steak kebab <laughs> may not sound that exciting but it should taste delicious and that in terms of presentation looks like a pile of shit if i thought my kebab was overcooked that's nothing compared to what's happening to my creme catalana there's all that smoke coming out of the kitchen is that okay from there? your dessert <laughs> from yes. my dessert it's just when they, they burn the top burn the top well not burn the top <laughs> yeah, that's like they burn the kitchen down Fuck me. Well, it's certainly burnt. It looks like a fucking ice hockey puck. Look at it. Comes with an appointment at the dentist tomorrow morning at 9.30. Fuck me. It's liquid and it's, it's ruined. So when you're sat with all these fresh ingredients on your doorstep and the climate they've got, the simpler it is, the better it's going to be. Kevin, bring it out. Wow. Oh Chicken wrap shrimp. Thank you. Chicken and shrimp. Well, I've got the chicken, and where's the shrimp? Bingo. No, I'm struggling with that. Looks like chicken, tastes like shrimp. Or oh, shit. Good. They are solid. I've never had a shrimp that hard. Why would you stick a shrimp inside a chicken? It's one of his creations. Okay. Okay, because. I was about to say, did he say chicken? What did that dude say? Sh uh, chicken rat shrimp? What? I guess. Okay. You ready? Jesus. Oh, yes, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Jesus. Get that shit the fuck up out of here. Your shrimp was too hard. Rock hard like a bullet. Okay. He says, why would you put shrimp inside of a chicken? He says, I don't get it. <laughs> no cap. Right. When the first dish came back, I was I, I was disgusted, pissed off, 
I wanted to prove him wrong. I wanted to show him my cooking skills, you know, are up to par. Somebody please run this fucking food. That's a bolognese. Thank you. And there's a salmon. Thank you. Okay. Christ almighty. Um, dry. Mm. And absolutely hideous. Damn. Pretty silent. Dry. Like, really dry. Okay. Would you mind just... Um, Not a problem. Would you like another piece? Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. Thank you. Would you like another piece? Your salmon was too dry. He don't want another piece. He said this was brutal. Here you go. You want to taste it? What is this? A fucking Italian mob family? Who the fuck is that? The retired hitman? Carrying out fucking food with his chain on? Throw it out. When it came back, I was just too pissed off to even taste it. I was furious at Chef Ramsay saying that my food is shit. And this is the chitlins and okra. Okay, chitlins. You see, oh my. I mean, I know chitlins are the intestine, but should they really stink? Before I do taste them, I'd like to pray to God before I put any of that in my mouth. <laughs> In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, you are blessed. <laughs> we rebuke the spirit of the devil. Damn. You are prayed over. We guarantee. One thing about black people, we're going to get some motherfucking religion and some church. Lord have mercy. I you that you are not about to succumb to those chitlins. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name. <laughs> you Man, at least give him some fucking hot sauce with the shit. You'll be fine. <laughs> I just had to pray over Chef before he ate the chitlins. What the fuck? There's no prayers gonna save me on this one. Oh my god. Whoa. Chitlins. Shitlins. I need the toilet, excuse me. I knew they'd come out quicker than they went in. Chef Ramsey is a mess. Oh, this chitlins are gross. Lettuce. I mean, Dog, can't I'm go wrong. Crying. You want to continue cooking? All right, y'all. Nah, that shit was funny. That shit was funny. I ain't gonna lie, man. But like always, man. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Drop some videos y'all want me to react to, and I will see y'all next time.